we are big. We don't, we don't even come to Lagos to perform. There was one when I called a manager, how we see the big guy, yeah. finally, you know, sign us to his label and started pushing us. Of course, he met a woman mm. who works in an agency. So he gave the woman our CD. The woman's uh, CD got stuck in her, in her car. So for the past few months, anytime the woman is driving, she has any no, no any song to play than the P Square song. Wow! And she kept on playing the song, and she loved the song. So whenever they are doing shows, she the calls Square. You guys. She calls her. She wants P Square. Well, what do we do? We'll go backstage. We say, "Ah, that madam is there." We'll go there. Thank you, man. Thank you, Roma. You will thank the woman. After performance, we go and meet that. Thank you, man. We were doing that, doing that, till. Our manager, after four years plus, we he got, you know, we our relationship went south or so, mm. and uh, then, of course, the manager refused to give us that woman's contact. Mm. But somehow, me and my manager have somehow gone there twice. So when mm. along Antonio. So I now call my manager's, our uh, former manager's PA. So they say, no, the woman is, I don't know, we don't know the, I started looking for it. Oh, moving to Lego. And I found the woman. And we continue from the woman. But sorry to say, that woman is my wife today. Wow! Wow! Yeah. Wow! This is where some things people don't know. So the life. story between that that story of the relationship and the love you have for her goes way back before before champagne and holiday before the also, my brother, I won't lie to you. I don't care what her people say I don't care that I'm there for her I was a nobody when if I was, should be who should be who should be grateful that that woman <laughs> did what she did for us but like I say you know um these are the kind of people that want to look at be like these people, you know, um, these people were there. Stadium, arena, this arena concert. So I don't know. I won't say I'm making more money. We are making more money now. The money are free us. Music is not forever. There are people that have not lasted in this, inside this industry. To a, we are talking about two decades plus. Hmm. This is my 25 years in the industry. If they tell me that I see they do the music, I'm tasting a lot. Mona free me. I want to gather everything where I go. Nothing lasts forever. I told you guys. I was talking about Pop Daddy. I was Pop Daddy in Dubai. You know, say to me, we were talking. I watched Pop Daddy. He was performing a song that he did 12, 13, 14, 15 years ago. Yeah. We were backstage in Dubai. Now, let me tell you what happened. Then we'll see the thing cast. So the next day, we had a party. So we sat down. Before we went for the part where well, my, my team and his people were just talking with the son. And let me tell you what happened. When we were talking about the industry, he now said to me, When we, am I am I he now said, Are you are you acquainted with Forbes? I said, Yeah. If you're acquainted with Forbes, if I tell you who are the top richest musicians, who are you gonna name? Give me give me top five. You, I say you, yep. Kanye, yep. Fifty Cent, Jay Z, Doctor Dre. Say hold on. When was the last time we released the song? I said I can't remember. So that's it. You have a fan base. Go set up something. Create wow an empire, world for yourself. But I look and say maybe this guy said the truth because my brother who broke in the laugh. Now, who mm. broke nine of his feet do music? Because if he broke, you know, if he did music. So I just say, you know what? And I said, I said that two and a half years ago, I went back. I said, man, Peter, you're right, business at me. You people, man. Mm. So they set it up. So I set up my, my lottery platform, set up my bidding platform. Next month, come 20th, 25th of next month, I'm proud owner of a spot betting company, Zoom Bet. Just like the bet Niger and the rest of them. I got the wow. license. I'm starting next month. I have my clothing line. I have a liquor. Everyone knows Afro. All right? I have a drink. Wow. Afro. 
I have my clothing line that's coming out in summer. You know what I'm saying? And I'm bringing down Peter back. I've signed five years deal already. I'm bringing down Peter back. And I have a reality TV show that I've been shooting for the past five years called The Okoyes. Wow! So, it's a busy year for me. Call it bragging, call whatever. I'm going to see him. Like I talk, I'm an open book. You must not like me. If you don't like me, I'm calling me. I don't beg anybody. 